I'm Executive Director Kevin Robertson, and this is the KDA Video Minute for Thursday, January 19th. The KDA's legislative agenda proposes ways in which real dentists can provide care to Kansans throughout the state. Uh, funding loan forgiveness programs, uh, creating opportunities for dentists to do more charitable care, as well as uh, funding donated dental services and Medicaid uh, for all Kansans. Well, this week the session is still ramping up. Of course, Monday was Martin Luther King Jr. Day, so the, the state, which is a state holiday, the legislature was closed that day. Uh, mostly this week, the legislature and the committees are looking at different initiatives that Governor Brownback has. For example, uh, what's in his budget, uh, some of the reform packages that he has for the CAPERS program, uh, Medicaid, and the tax reforms that he's uh, announced, as well as school financing and other things. So committees are looking at those different initiatives. As a result, there haven't been a, hasn't been a lot this week with regard to dentistry or, or really with uh, the overall oral health issues at all. Uh, so we're continuing to, to work on things and obviously prepare ourselves for more issues that will come up later in the session. Tomorrow, Friday, January 20th, the Kansas Dental Board is meeting and the Kansas Dental Association will have the opportunity to talk about uh, the dental workforce, some things in our comprehensive oral health initiative and things we're interested in, uh, including uh, our opinion of the registered dental practitioner. Also at that uh, meeting will be uh, representatives of the Kansas Action for Children, who of course support the registered dental practitioner. So uh, the dental board will have an opportunity to hear both sides of that discussion and then weigh in on that as well. Then next Friday, on Friday, January 27th, the House Health and Human Services Committee will be holding a roundtable on dental workforce issues. Uh, members of the Kansas Dental Association, myself, will, will be part of that committee discussion, which will again include members of the Kansas Dental Project, Kansas Action for Children, Kansas Association Medically Underserved, and other people who support the mid-level non-dentist provider legislation. So. Uh, that's not a hearing per se, but certainly both sides of the issue will be uh, expressed and it'll be an opportunity to discuss this uh, in an open forum uh, without a, an official hearing. So that's a way that the committee uh, does gather information from time to time and so we're, we're certainly interested and excited about participating in that particular issue. Then the following Thursday, February 2nd, is our dental day uh, activities that we hold annually here in Topeka. Uh, it's an opportunity for you to come to Topeka, talk about the issues that you're interested in with regard to dentistry, and then you have an opportunity then to express those to your legislators. We hope you'll attend. Of course, we always start off the day with a little session that uh, includes an up-to-date discussion of our issues. Then we'll have uh, a press conference and talk about a new initiative that the Kansas Dental Association will be uh, introducing on that particular day. We'll have lunch with legislators at noon, and then you'll have more opportunity to sit in on committee hearings uh, and both the House and the Senate in that afternoon. So we hope you'll attend. Uh, if you're in Wichita, I know that there's an effort to get together a bus to come up, so that'll make it very convenient and easy for you to join with your peers to come up to Topeka. Uh, hopefully some other districts will be doing the same. So we hope to see you on Thursday, February 2nd for Dental Day 2012. And finally, that brings me to KMOM. Kansas City, which will be on February 17th and 18th, 65th and State Avenue in Kansas City, Kansas. We're looking forward to seeing many of you there. Uh, please register as soon as possible so we can keep track of all those that might be attending. We're going to have a bigger clinic, plan to treat more people, and uh, just really uh, have a great day of, of, of dental giving as we do at every Mission of Mercy project. So I hope you appreciate the shortened version of the KDA Video Minute. And we look forward to talking to you again next week. Thank you.